images that stunned Taiwan. Photos showing lawmaker Gao Jiayu's injuries after an alleged assault by her boyfriend. Gao has accused Lin Binshu of hitting her repeatedly. Following an argument before barring her from leaving the hotel room the couple were staying in last month, Gao shed tears as she described what happened. This process, I don't know how to handle it. When I was there, I was just shaking. I don't even know who I am. My mouth is full of blood, and he is holding my neck. And I feel like I'm going to die. Lin was taken into police custody early on Wednesday morning. Premier Su Zhenchang condemned the violence. Female lawmakers from ruling and opposition parties have been quick to express their support for Gao. 所有的暴力发生都是不对的，不论她是立法委员，或者是只是一般的女性，不管是怎样，我还是鼓励她要勇敢哈，还是要，还是最终还是要爱自己多一点。Taiwan's President Tsai Ing-wen has signed a new bill into law, taking aim at stalking and harassment following a series of high-profile incidents of violence against women in the past year. 有了这部专法，未来对于不当的跟跟踪及骚扰行为。公权力可以提早介入，提防、提提早防范危害。在这条路上，我们永远可以做得更多，做得更好。未来我们会持续的努力，让全体的国人的生活更加的安全，更加的安心。With the new law now in place, Taiwan has taken a positive step towards strengthening legal protections for women. But Gao's case proves that even those in powerful positions are not immune to domestic abuse. The hope is that it can spark a wider conversation about violence against women and how Taiwan can do more to help victims. Kamashi and Pichu Zhang for Taiwan Plus.